In this problem, we're going to use synthetic division to determine the quotient and remainder uh, due to this division, and then we're going to write the division statement. So the first thing we're going to do is set up our synthetic division. So I'm going to draw that half box symbol. And then we're going to convert our divisor to that x minus a form. So you see right now we have x plus something, which we can rewrite as x minus negative that same thing. So x minus negative 3. So our a value in this x minus a form is negative 3. So that's what I'm going to write outside of the half box symbol. Now I'm going to bring down the coefficients of the dividend polynomial. So the first coefficient is a 1. Then we have a 5 on the x squared, negative 2 on the x, and negative 24 as our constant term. Remember the first step to synthetic division is always to bring down the first coefficient. The 1 will just come right underneath the half box symbol. Now I multiply negative 3 by 1, which is going to give me negative 3. I'll write that here. And I have 5 minus 3, which is 2. And I multiply negative 3 times 2 to give me negative 6, which I'll write under the next coefficient. And I have negative 2 minus 6, which is negative 8. And then I multiply negative 3 times negative 8 to give me negative 24. Or sorry, positive 24. And then I have negative 24 plus 24, which gives me 0. Now I've reached the end of my synthetic division. Here's my remainder of 0. And these are the coefficients of the terms on my uh, quotient polynomial. So let's interpret the result from right to left. We know the remainder is 0. Negative 8 is going to be the constant term. 2 is going to be the coefficient on the x term. And 1 is going to be the coefficient on the x squared term. So our quotient is x squared plus 2x minus 8, and our remainder is 0. Maybe I'll write that. q of x is x squared plus 2x minus 8. Our remainder is 0. And to write the division statement, we have to remember that it takes the form p of x equals q of x p of x plus r of x, where p of x is the dividend polynomial, so that's this guy here. Uh, q of x is the quotient, which is written here. p of x is the divisor, x plus 3, and r of x is the remainder, which is 0. So we can write that x cubed plus 5x squared minus 2x minus 24 is equal to q of x, x squared plus 2x minus 8, and that entire thing is being multiplied by d of x, a divisor x plus 3. And then we're going to add our remainder, but our remainder is just 0. So we actually don't have to write anything. So this is the division statement for this problem.